In the Philippines, President Rodrigo Duterte said on Monday he would rather have either one of his two Sanchez critics become the next president than have his daughter Davao City Mayor Sara Duterte succeed him. In a pre-recorded public address, or address Duterte again expressed disapproval after his daughter expressed openness to join the presidential race in 2022. Take a look. My stand is, uh, I am against really the candidacy of my daughter. I want her spared from the, itong, the vagaries of politics dito sa Pilipinas. Lalo na itong mga personalities around in the likes of Trillanes, uh, si Dilema. Oh, wala walang ginawa kung hindi mag-atake ng kapwa-tao nila. So I would rather that ibigay ang gobyerno sa kanila. Let them win if they, I wish them luck and even uh, wish them win. Uh, kung manalo sila para kanila na itong guberno at uh, gawin nila ang gusto nilang gawin. Na masasaktan ako pag uh, siyempre anak ko. Uh, itong bastos, itong bunga nga ni uh, Trillanes. Ewan ko kung saan niya nakuha yung katangian na yan. Uh, pati itong si Dilima. Describing Trillanes and Delima as being both hungry for power, Duterte said it only made sense for either of the two to have a taste of the presidency so that they could also be judged by the Filipino people. Sara, he said, could still run for president some other time. He also reiterated that the presidency is a job that is not good for a woman, especially because criticisms could only hurt her. Meanwhile, Duterte admitted that he is only considering running as vice president next year to scare off his critics. During a meeting with members of ruling Partido Democratico Filipino Lakas ng Bayan or PDP Laban, Duterte said he is sold to the idea of joining the vice presidential race next year. He said he is seriously thinking of accepting his party mates' appeal for him to seek the second top post in the country.